Hello there, if you're just quickly looking for good settings for the mentioned system, then here it is quickly shown for you. Most important is resolution skill at 80%, shadows high, AA uh, type temporal, but you can try other types, uh, set to high as well. I said, of course, a competition really needs that high AA. VR pixel density, aka super sampling set to 150 so that's my preferred settings for the gtx 1070 dti with a processor i7 8700k besides those settings in Osseto Corsa Competizione also even more important is to run it with ASW asynchronous warping if you have an oculus rift cv1 or rift s then go to this directory so C program files, Oculus support, Oculus diagnostics, and run the Oculus debug tool, which is uh, this. And then asynchronous space warp instead of leaving it on auto, force 45 FPS, ASW enabled. If you do not have a Rift, then you can go to Steam VR. Steam VR you can launch here, uh, top right, and then this will open, and then here you can click settings, will take you to this screen, video, per application video settings, you go to set the course competizione, uh, motion smoothing, force always on. That that should be all for you, but uh, if you're interest, interested, then uh, keep watching uh, and I'll explain and show to you the, uh, the three settings on how to make it look sharp. So if you need some more modification, if it doesn't run for you this way, then, uh, then keep watching and check how it all works. The Freak Show. So the problem in Assetto Corsa Competizione in VR is really uh, the performance, it's not very great. So it's very difficult to get a stable 80 or 90 FPS or for the Valve v index even more. That's why you use asynchronous warping to uh, interpolate those, those uh, frames, which basically means that instead of running on uh, 90, you run on 45 FPS and you let the graphics card create images out of two images, so in between each uh, frame. Uh, so it's, it's taking a guess of what it should look like. Uh, that does make for some artifacts, but in my opinion it's not that bad. Uh, it's just some ghosting on cars that, that are in front of you and the uh, windscreen wiper. Now, the other problem is that it's a blurry mess. If you want to run it stable, 90 FPS or 80 FPS, you'd probably have to turn stuff down. So that's why with ASW, you can actually turn stuff up a lot more and actually make a more crisp image. There's three settings that basically make for this crisp image, uh, which is resolution skill, anti-aliasing, I will call it AA further on, and VR pixel density. This is super sampling. Let's put everything down so that we can start from the beginning. We will need a full grid because uh, in multiplayer also usually you have 20 people and more racing, so we'll need that actually. So here we have it, the hot blurry mess that is ACC with everything on low settings. Now let's go and change this. <laughs> Firstly, we change the resolution scale from 50 to 100 to show you the actual native resolution. Now this is better, it's um, yeah, only slightly better, isn't it? I mean, with no AA, it's still very uh, pixelated, it's not very uh, smooth and, and, and kind of calm picture. So, if you turn up anti-aliasing uh, to mid, still has problems, I'll show you. It's a lot better, but I don't find it that chill still. So then anti-aliasing to high. And this is, is pretty good. It did become a little bit more washed, like blurry.
and that is where the super sampling really helps. However, when we change the, the super sampling, the pixel density from 100 to 150, that is likely going to be too much. Yeah, we see um, it's shaking really. So unfortunately, this is kind of what it should look like, I guess. But it's too, it's too much. So all three of these settings, resolution skill, anti-aliasing and pixel density are really demanding. So you're gonna have to kind of play with them to see what is right for you, what works. Put back resolution skill to 80%. Anti-aliasing, I do feel this has to be at high. And uh, pixel density 150. All right. I hope you can see the ghosting. I hope you can see the ghosting. A little bit on the, on the on the right of that car. It's sort of like a anime type of effect. But that's basically the only downside to this is this ghosting effect uh, on cars and well on your windscreen wipers when um, when there's rain, heavy rain. But uh, this is a lot better than having this hot blurry mess, the, the very pixelated mess. The interpolation otherwise does a great job of just keeping everything smooth and um, I mean otherwise it's, it's, it's very hard to keep a steady 80, 90 FPS while 40 or 45 FPS is very doable. And you can even turn these settings up. Car on the left. Now, I just want to quickly show you on the, left. the shadow setting. Uh, the shadows, if you put them to mid even, I mean to low, you s start. they start to basically disappear. And here you see the car in front of us. When you keep a certain distance, it's not a full shadow. Uh, yeah, if I if I get close enough here, it is. But here it really isn't. Ah, I mean there it really isn't. <laughs> now another option is to actually uh, keep the resolution skill down. Let's say to fifty percent, and up the uh, pixel density from uh, I mean to two hundred percent, for instance. This gives a different effect although really just slightly yeah this is sort of similar I guess either is good this, this seems really similar so that's really what you should be doing is playing with these three settings uh, I mean probably just swapping um, the amounts for for uh, pixel density and resolution skill. <clears throat> Let me just quickly show you the artifact on the windscreen wiper. So <laughs> here you see the windscreen wiper. Um, basically, the windscreen is being cleaned just after the the, the wiper was there. Uh, that's that's a bit of an artifact. But, I mean, you know, how bad is that in comparison to a very pixelated or non-stable FPS, really? I would really rather have this than that. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope these settings work for you. Um, I think a lot more people are starting to enjoy Assetto Corsa Competizione very much. Um, especially since it's now doable because the uh, popular opinion was for a long time that it really wasn't doable to play in yes, VR. Fuck, I'm fucking up my SR here really. I mean my SA. But uh, this, this, this happily... I'm happy to play with this. What is going on? Okay, whatever. Someone is... Uh, someone's balked. What are you doing? Alright, I just need to quit because th fuck this shit. Okay. Uh, SA. God damn it.
thanks for watching and um, see you next time. <laughs>